Hey everyone, I'm Jordan Spivey, joined with my dad, Travis Spivey. And if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on any of our awesome science videos. Question, do waves transfer energy or matter? In today's video, we will answer that question by explaining the basic characteristics of waves. So let's do this. Our learning targets for today are, number one, I can explain the characteristics of waves, and number two, I can explain the relationship among wavelength, frequency, and energy in electromagnetic waves. All waves have five basic characteristics, which are crest, trough, wavelength, amplitude, and frequency. Let's go over some of these basic characteristics by analyzing the following electromagnetic wave. A is the crest or top of the wave. D is the trough or bottom of the wave. B and E represent the wavelength or how far it is between crest to crest or trough to trough of the wave. You can tell how many waves there are by using your finger to trace where the wave begins and where it comes back to the exact point. I like to have my students say up, down, up or down, up, down depending on if the wave went up or down from the beginning and put a line representing one full wave. Let's look at the following wave. Here is the starting point of the wave and here is the ending point of this first wave. If I follow this wave train to the end, I can tell that there are four full waves on this wave train. A wave train is two or more waves. So quick quiz, how many full waves do you see in the following wave trains? Pause the video to answer these questions. Amplitude is represented by C and F on this diagram. Amplitude is the amount of distance from the resting position of a wave to the top or bottom of a wave. The higher the amplitude, the more energy a wave is carrying. The lower the amplitude, then the wave is carrying less energy. Question, which of the following waves is carrying the most amount of energy? Which wave has the highest amplitude? What is the relationship between amplitude and energy? Frequency is the number of waves that pass a fixed point in a given amount of time. The more waves that pass a point in a given amount of time, then the higher the frequency. A lower frequency would be represented by fewer waves passing a point in a given amount of time. So basically, the higher the frequency, the shorter the wavelength and the more energy a wave is carrying. The lower the frequency, the longer the wavelength and the less energy a wave is carrying. Now let's check for understanding. Which of the following waves has the highest frequency? Which wave is carrying the least amount of energy? And what is the relationship between wavelength, frequency, and energy? So back to our original question. Do waves carry energy or matter? Let's look at the following example of this guy diving into the pool while the lady relaxes on a donut pool float. Notice how when he dives into the pool, the lady's pool float doesn't move much at all. Also, observe all the waves around her. None of these waves are causing her to move significantly from her floating position. So question, are these waves carrying matter? Look at this example. Notice how these waves are crashing into the ocean wall. So two questions. What do you think is causing these waves to crash so hard? Once again, are waves carrying matter or energy? Defend your answer with your observations of the evidence provided in this video. And that's our video for today. Now let's test your knowledge to see how proficient you are with explaining the characteristics of waves by taking our video quiz. Use your electronic device to scan the QR code at the top right of the screen, or you can click the link in the description box below to take the video quiz. Remember, 80% are high for proficiency, record your associate proficiency sheet, and if you don't get it the first time, you better keep going because it's not over until you win. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button, and also click that bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our awesome videos. Peace, and have a positive, productive day.